all doing well. Oh, hang on, I need to set the game capture. There we go. Hope you're all doing well, guys. This should be all working for you now. There we go. So yeah, there's no audio, I don't think. <laughs> I don't think we've got any audio yet. Uh, so yeah, hope you, hope everyone's doing fine. As always, like the stream, guys, and all of that good stuff. Um, strong contrast mode, subtitle. Uh, let's put. Uh, let's put subtitles on, for so everyone can see. Oh, that's a bit too bright. Uh, wait. Okay. There we go. Wow. There we go. Driven oh. from their homes by armed invaders, a few hardy refugees faced the prospect of starting again. They would found a new village deep in the countryside. Wait, what? With a new settlement established, the first priority was locating a reliable food source. The simplest source was gathering from nature. Uh, don't know why, why, why is it giving me this? I know how to play, I, I, uh, beta tested this, so. Yeah, let's check. Yeah, I don't need, I don't need a tutorial, let's be honest. Right. So yeah, I'm pretty much, uh, gonna be just playing the campaign today. Um, I want to see what's changed on this menu from when I was um, under ND when I was playing it. Um, it looks all the same. Single player, multiplayer. See, this was all blacked out when it well blued out um, when I was uh, testing the game. So I had no idea what the hell was going to go here. Yeah. Damn, got a really good connection. Um, this is a this is good. This um, uh, like this community bitch about about like the videos and stuff. I like that. Uh, so yeah. Let's. Get cracking. Right. Uh, let's do campaign. Wait, they're no, 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 no. They're the art of war ones, aren't they? All right. So you've got to start off as the Normans. Okay. Let's take a look. Um. Uh, so like, this game is actually quite difficult, even on intermediate, um, unless they've tuned it even more since, um, uh, since I was, like, um, uh, beta testing it. It was actually quite difficult. Um, uh, the story without, uh, no, let's just go intermediate, let's, uh, I hope that they've kept the, um, the, the uh, priest as they have in the did in the beta. Some events leave a deep mark on history, but none on the land. This is the site of the Battle of Hastings. After almost a thousand years, no traces of the bloody conflict can be seen. Hmm. But here. The fate of England turned. It's where a king was killed. This is pretty cool how they've done this. Claimed the throne. I do like that. October 14th, 1066. We know what happened here on this day. Thanks to this. The Bayer Tapestry. Mm-hmm. 
carefully preserved illustrated record of events. That is pretty cool, that. It shows the main players. Harold, the newly crowned Anglo-Saxon King of England. And his challenger, William, Duke of Normandy. William claimed the previous king had promised him the crown. So, he assembled an army and prepared to sail to England to fight King Harold for the throne. I quite like this, how they've done this, actually. But a storm thwarted his plans. Meanwhile, Harold discovered that a Viking invasion had landed in the north. Another threat to his crown. So he raced to fight them. In France, William waited for the right conditions to sail across the channel to England. The weather cleared. He seized his chance. Two hundred and fifty miles north, Harold had defeated the Vikings. Now, hearing of William's arrival, his army sped south. I wonder what happened. At nine o'clock in the morning, <laughs> on this hill, William's Norman army were ready to do battle with Harold's Anglo-Saxon men. The stage was set, and up for grabs, England itself. Oh. All right, William, uh, William of Normandy began his conquest of England, but to end the Anglo-Saxon rule, he would first have to kill their king. It's unfortunate. The castle walls in this game are absolutely mental because you can add like towers to them and stuff like that. I went crazy in, uh, when I was uh, alpha test, uh, beta, beta testing it. Um, On October 14th, 1066, William of Normandy stood ready for battle at the base of a hill. The high ground belonged to King Harold of England and his Anglo-Saxon army. Here, on this hilltop, the fate of England would be decided. Attack Harold's Saxon army. Uh, can you still double click? William's Norman army made the first charge, launching a direct assault on the shield wall. I can spread them out. Though William's army fought fiercely against the shield wall, it would not yield. As one man fell, another took his place. Overlapping shields in tight formation made for a near impenetrable barrier. Hey, Sour, how are you doing? Realizing his army could not break the shield wall, William called for. You having a good day? He aimed to lure the Anglo Saxons into a false sense of victory. Causing them to break formation. William's feigned retreat was working. The Anglo Saxon army broke their shield wall formation, leaving gaps for William to make a move. Uh, I've been waiting for so long for this to come out. I'm a massive Age of Empires fan.
The Anglo-Saxons had deployed rows of spearmen to push back the invaders. But William had an answer. His sharp-eyed archers. Uh, I, I absolutely love Age of Empires. More Norman men-at-arms reinforced William's army. Um, if you've got Xbox Game Pass, you can actually uh, play this for free. Additional Norman archers joined the battle. William has formed. Select a unit, right click to William order to revive him. Anglo Saxon archers joined the fray, and the Normans' deadly cavalry ready to charge. But first, William's forces had to eliminate the enemy spearmen, whose sturdy pole arms could easily bring down a horse. How am... Like, what? I'm pretty sure this is how uh, the Battle of Hastings didn't go. We just kept on uh, having more troops just coming from the side of the map. Alright, so you've got to revive your main dude. I like, I like that. Alright, archers get back. Get all the archers back. Kill them. Oof. of spearmen cleared from the field William's cavalry was free to charge at the Anglo-Saxon archers yeah let's get the marchers out the way let's get them archers let's get them in line actually let's get them there Saxon army was in disarray. Their shield wall had been neutralized. Where's my main guy? Let's go and res my main dude. Now the only thing standing between William and victory was King Harold himself. What are these lazy guys down here? Go on, get up there. The last of Harold's men encircled their king, prepared to lay down their lives to save his. King Harold. Oh, wait. Get back. Oh, there he is there. Should be able to kill him, actually. Did I get him? It's hard to see which one there is the king. There we go. Saxon King Harold had fallen. In the confusion, some loyal soldiers fought to the death, while others scattered in panic. Victorious. God, run your peasants. Leaderless and defeated. The last of the Anglo-Saxon army fled for their lives. 
the Normans celebrated victory over the English king. But William's quest to rule England was just beginning. GG. Uh, right. Unlock content. Building the castle video. Uh, already not do that. Uh, right. Quite like it. I've got like all these little uh, videos and stuff like that. That's pretty neat. Reward. Wait, what's the reward? At the Battle of Hastings, the death of one man changed the course of history. The Anglo-Saxon King Harold was killed here, on England's south coast. His army defeated by William of Normandy. Anglo-Saxon rule was over forever. London. At Westminster Abbey on Christmas Day 1066, William was crowned the first Norman King of England. Now he had to secure power across the country. He began by stamping his mark on the landscape, building cathedrals and castles at strategic locations. Mm -hmm. Nothing like them had been seen in England ah. before. They reminded the Anglo-Saxon population Exactly. Got a big um, Norman castle next to where I live. But not all were content with living under Norman rule. Anglo Saxon revolts broke out across the country. King William acted quickly to crush these rebellions. But there was one region where dissent was spiraling out of control the north of England. Yep. In 1069, a group of lords from Northumbria formed an alliance with Viking invaders. Good old Northumbria. Together they approached Norman held York. A large city with an important cathedral, still protected by ancient Roman walls. But the walls couldn't save York. The city and the castle fell to the rebels. William's new kingdom was under threat. He had to get the city back under Norman control. William had no choice but to order his men north. But as the Norman forces set off on their long march towards York, how much resistance from the rebels would they encounter? I really do. Hey, Arresta, how you doing, mate? I really like how they've done this, or like uh, with the story of uh, like England and everything. Are you having a good day, mate? So yeah, I'm just doing the campaigns on uh, Age of Empires 4. It's literally just released at 4 p.m. my time, so um. I be I tested this, but I was under like NDA, so I couldn't really speak about it. William the Conqueror marched north with his army of Normans determined to take back the rebel held city of York. But in his path stood rebel towns that harbored William's northern enemies. He would take the towns back by force. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm not too bad, thanks. Uh, I've just been really busy the past couple of days doing stuff for the uh, the channel and stuff like that. Um, like I said, like I said uh, on a community post on YouTube the other day that I was going to be streaming this today. Um, so, right, what am I doing? Reclaim your capital, uh, capture Middlethorpe.
I need to change the uh, mouse sensitivity. That is crazy, that. Um... Uh, camera game, UI, uh, oh, come on, rotate, there has got to be like a, a, a sensitivity, a sensitivity, right? Mouse pan speed. Let's try that. See if that works. That's a bit better. All right, onwards to York. In fact, is this a is this a max graphics? Um. Uh. Let's go to full screen. Okay. Okay. Image quality high. Yeah, I've got HDR turned off. I did mix to uh, HDR. Just mix stuff. To uh, okay. There we go. I guess this is on Xbox Games Pass, so you can actually play it, um, like now, if you've just got Xbox Game Pass. So what do you think of the new channel uh, intro? Do you like it? Uh, I need to get their attention. <laughs> Idiot. Kill. If I find it immediate too easy, I will uh, crank it up to hard. Get them archers. Oh, wait, 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 what? Oh, there we go. The Normans captured the town of Middlethorpe, establishing the do, yeah, in the yeah. With uh, reinforcements to his army soon arriving. William would need more resources to supply them. Build up your economy. Tag model, what the hell? Why is that saying tag model? I think that's a... Uh, I think this game needs patching again. <laughs> it's got like uh, placeholders by the looks of it. Uh, okay. Let's repair that. Yeah, my friend, she uh, done the intro. Uh, she done my new um, logo. Um, sign more berry. Uh, where is it? Berry bushes. Where the berry bushes are? Uh, 
Nintendo. Let's find some berry bushes. Yeah, let's go and hunt this dude. The, when I was uh, beta testing this a um, uh, couple of months ago, I, I enjoyed it. I was like, oh, but it's too much. That it, it, but at the time, it felt like a mixture of uh, oh, there, there, there. It felt like it was a mixture of Age of Empires three and Age of Empires two. It was like a weird. Uh, but now it feels a lot more. Um, a lot different to what I did then. All right. Um, let's get them on the farms. Got them hunting. Farms are different on this as well, unless they've changed them. They get parceled up into little, little tiles. Um, build for for uh, was a build for additional farms. How much uh, food do I have? Four ten. Um, got plenty of housing. That's good. So I need two more houses and five villagers to chop wood. Don't. Can I turn this audio by a bit more? Um, apparently not. Right. Um. Okay. Let's have a look here. Lumber camp. Build that there. But yeah, I think one of the coolest uh, things about it. One of the coolest differences about this is like the walls. The walls work so so differently um, in this to do uh, what they do on um, other Age of Empires. Do you know what? I don't know if uh, how many of you have uh, played the original any of that uh, Age of Empires, but see these scouts here? Yeah? These are um so what you do is with these watch You can herd sheep and then you can pull them all then they'll like run behind you. So like on other Age of Empires you used to be able to get sheep and um and all that stuff, yeah? Um, but now you can pick up huge numbers of these and they'll run behind you. These scouts are like really important early on. Um. Edifico. Uh, what do I need now? One more wood chopper. Hey. Two houses and four farms. Easy. Oh, no, 
I'll probably end up getting this for Steam, to be honest. I like having all my games on Steam. Even though I've got a uh, Xbox Game Pass, uh, was it Ultimate? Okay. All right. So if you see this, yeah, this mill, it has like little tiles behind it, and it produces a higher uh, output if you have a mill next to your farms. But you only can build nine farms. Uh, around the mill, but they have like a high output. Because if you don't have a mill, they'll end up just walking back and forth to the town centre. And to go up in ages and um, age of empires, boys, well, you've got to build special structures. And you've got like, unless it's changed, um, and then you have to pick, once you've built the structure, like for the age, you have to pick like something, like a special like ability or something like that. Oh, do No, I don't want that, wait what? Why am I pressing the wrong things here? Farm, there we go. Alright. Got quite a few uh, upgrades on this one, uh, Age of Empires as well. Like in the first age. The Norman army was now well supplied by a town. But it would take a sustained effort to keep the army at full strength. Reinforcements have arrived. Nice. Another rebel town, Fulford, stood in defiance to William's rule. Capture Fulford. Okay. Finish doing these farms first. Alright. Gonna have to build a couple of more houses soon. Um. So, yeah. Yeah, this is where you build uh, mills. Farms near mills are, ho are harvested 15% faster. Farm harvest rate increased by 15% while within the influence of the mill. So that hasn't changed since uh, I tested the game. I don't think anyways. Um... Let's get that. There's all my archers, get them there. Another good thing about this as well, this uh, Age of Empires, um, is the monks or priests have to hold a relic to be able to convert an enemy troop. So you can't just spam um, uh, priests, monks or whatever. Um, You've got to, um... Hey, a corn are we doing? So you've got to have, like, a priest or a monk holding a relic to be able to convert the troops. That is, that is another one of my favourites from when I was, um, uh, testing this game. How are you doing, corn, mate? Escolta 
Um, let's get them on the wood. Get, get two builders. Well, keep them two um, guys back for building. What's this? Survival technique increases uh, villagers armor by one. Hunted meat carry capacity plus two. That's pretty good. Hunted meat gather rate by 30%. Villagers deal 100% more damage against wild animals. Um, you know what? I never know whether to take offense of that, you know, or not, uh, corn. <laughs> I appreciate it, though. Thank you. <laughs> right, I need him to go there. Uh, let's send a scout forward. Okay. Absolutely routed them. No, this is a completely um um. I'm a massive Age Empires fan. No, no, this is um This is brand new, completely gay, New Age Vampires, mate. It's just been released uh, 20 minutes ago. Uh, this is like actually Age of Empires 4, like not a definitive edition, like remake or anything like that. This is just flat out a completely New Age of Empires. I want these more compact wedge. Let's get that. Here, at least I'm watching your, watching, watching your stream sort of. Yeah, mate. I'm not complaining one single bit. I'm not complaining at all. Right. Okay. So, can you upgrade to the first age on this or not? Okay. So. Uh, mining camp, outport, uh, oh, them towers are still in it, nice. I'm glad they haven't changed these. These are really nice. Um, got a lumber camp, mining camp. Do we have any, uh, gold nearby? Because it was gold and silver, if I remember rightly. Um, not by the looks of it. We do have a barrack, so let's get that on the go. Do I have any? Where's them scouts gone? There we go. Hopefully, there's some gold on this uh, island. Absolutely tons of uh, wood, though. So now the thing is on 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 uh, Age of Empires 4, you 
you kind of hide your troops in the forest and they get like shrouded, like, you know, cover. And tons of sheep here. Looks like the original with the uh, Age of Empires one. No, no, like I said, this is uh, completely different to all the uh, Age of Empires, mate. Uh, like I said, it's not a definitive edition. It's not a remake. It's literally a brand new Age of Empires. Um. Oh, Age of Empires three. Yeah, that's absolutely nightmare, mate. Um, that I don't think that that was anybody's favorite. Um. Cavallo. Right. So this is what I was talking about. The sheep. Th th this scout can hurt them, and they run faster. But the minute you send the sheep off on their own, like this. Watch this. They'll walk slow. Oh, not on this account, mate. Like, they walk too slow. Like, I, 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 um... As be, as, I be, I tested all this, mate, but I was under NDA. Because uh, I'm a part of the Age, uh, the Age of Empires Insider program. Like, I, 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 be, I tested all the definitive editions as well. So I already pretty much know uh, the gameplay of this. Alright, so there's no gold here. Oh yeah, like I said, I've played Age Vampires since uh, Age Vampires 1. It was my first ever uh, online game. I've played every single one. It's a bit too much. I need to get a, a, a priest so I can start healing my stuff. Can't get too close to them walls. But yeah, she moved too slow if you haven't got a scout with you now. Um, let's have a look. I can't remember if you have to snap them on them or not. Cannot build here. I need to find some gold. Uh, it takes a pretty long time to uh, go up the ages on this. Like I said, you've got to build like a structure now. Like and then an additional structure to go up the ages. And you don't go up the age until the structure's uh, built.
All right, so I've got to capture this town here. Uh, see, this is just the uh, campaign, uh, the start of the uh, Norman campaign. China. Requirements age to the feudal age. One down. Advance to the feudal. But yeah, yeah. See that that that's what they called their landmarks. Um, I can't remember the name of the yeah uh, buildings. Oh, this is not good at all. I've got absolutely no gold whatsoever. I wonder if I can just take this uh, town without uh, having to build more troops. Um. Well, the way uh, stone walls, what you can do is you can place towers on, like snap them onto the walls and stuff like that but uh these ones these are just like what like outpost sees these aren't proper like towers these are just like basically line of sight Get them out of the uh, wedge formation. Ah, well, there's my gold. Archers are pretty OP on this still by the looks of it. Um, yeah, yeah, they're, they're in the game, but there's like a, a tap. Um, there's. There's like a trade center thing in the game now where you have to and you can trade with them directly on, 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 on skirmishes anyways. With the Fulford rebels eliminated, William was one step closer to York. Um, but yeah, um, there's like... he would face uh, strong resistance in the city. William prepared to bolster his cavalry. All right, let's get that. All right, got 8,000 gold there, nice. Uh, yeah, but there's like a trade center thing you can send your caravans to. So caravans are still a thing. Um, but I, I, I don't think they're going to be in the campaign, though. I think uh, they'll just be for the... Um... Hmm, for the... Um, what's it called? Oh, I didn't see that bloody mining camp there. Oh, I've got stone here as well. Nice. Uh... 
Alright. Send them there. Let's patch up these walls. There's um on skirmish mode. There's uh, also like a religious landmark you can capture. Uh, and, and you've got to hold it. It's like got a circle around it. Cavalry versus archers. Right, I want that. Um, get that in there. Got a gate there. Got a gate there and there. Oh, bloody hell. Um, let's build a barracks. Do I have a barracks here? No. Got a market here. So you can still sell stuff from your market. Get them on the gold. The Norman army came under attack from a new enemy, the Danes. Oh, what? Yeah, yeah, just riding like an absolute maniac on your own. That seems like a valid, um... All right, I can build the landmark now. Nice. I'll get on that in a minute. Once you get there, uh, the towers set up and get archers in the towers, you can just absolutely heal them. They're pretty, uh, pretty good. army held back the Danes attack but they threatened to return unless William paid them in gold <laughs> if you think I'm gonna be paying people we've got another thing coming some archers how many can that hold three not bad but yeah once you get stone walls though guys you can actually uh, have your troops there uh, like on on the uh, walls so. I think I'm going to start building the landmark here. So the Council Hall or the Abbey of Kings. Here are all nearby out of combat units by two. Um, I could go mental. Hey, Jacob, how are we doing? Can you heal your units? Yeah, you can. Um, You can even use priests. Uh-oh. Uh You can either use priests or um, use structure buffs, which I'm about to use in a second. Told you about the towers, didn't I? They, ha they haven't changed one single bit. They're still pretty uh, strong. Uh, 
All right, get these walls repaired. Um, right. So I'll show you that. Um, so this is one way you can heal your troops. Uh, you can have the Abbey of Kings. So when I go to uh, to get to the feudal age, let's uh, place that down. Now the only time, I'm, the only way I'm going to actually get the feudal age now though is by building this structure, and it takes a long time. So it's best to have like a couple of villagers working on it. Um, make sure I've got enough uh, villagers on the gold. Repair these walls. Okay. Get him on there. Food and wood is doing amazing here. Right, so there's the Dane camp there. That's all the walls repaired. Okay. Okay, there's the Danes coming back. Say these towers are really good. The towers can really suppress the um uh, suppress the enemy. Alright. There we go, uh, we've got the feudal building now. Was that the Abbey of Kings, wasn't it? So now, oh, that, does that affect, hang on. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, got a marker, blacksmith, archery range. Yeah, let's stack up on some archers. Upgrade our troops. What's this? Arrow slits. Add defensive arrow slits to this structure. Does that go for the mall? No, it doesn't. Wait, that's a hundred stone a piece? Hm. Yikes. Um, get a blacksmith down. I might as well just build them here. Send them up there to mine stone. Uh, just increase villagers gather rate by 15%. Hell yeah. Uh, increase villager gather rate by food by 10%. Of course. Them too bad, yeah, resource wise. Oh. So, this is the tower with the upgraded slits. <laughs> I 
I love it. All right. Archers, let's start stacking up our knees. I will look in here. Oh, they're both upgraded. Nice. Early man at arms. Did that upgrade them then? Early man at arms. Okay. Get them there. Get them there. Um, hmm. Heavy sledge increase. Okay. Okay. How much stone do I have there? Let's just upgrade all these towers. Let's put a stable there. I don't know if it'll uh, allow me to upgrade the stone this early on. Uh, Blue Murray. Increase the rare melee damage of all non siege units. Okay. Melee and ranged infantry can construct siege towers and battering rams in the field. That seems a little bit OP. I think I'll take it. <laughs> Actually, I'll take them all. Reinforcements have arrived. Ooh. Okay. 30 new troops. I'll send them up here. Actually, I could probably use them to go and take out the uh, the uh, camp. My troops should, in theory, be getting healed. Getting through. Yeah, I don't see any heal neither. They should be off the uh, off the uh, feudal building. Maybe I have to be next to the feudal building itself only. That would make sense. So it's fine. Once I get priests, um, they'll. Um, um, you know. Where's my uh, dude? Uh, well, woman, sorry. Yeah, I'm not running all my troops back down there. I'll just, uh, if I can get, if I can get priests at any point, uh, I'll um, just use them, it's easier. Alright. Let's go and pay a visit to this camp. Actually, let's send all the troops in. Oh, what's that? Oh, huh, an enemy sheep. It's a spy. I really don't like that wedge, wedge formation, to be fair. Should be killing these easy. I do like if they're losing the fight, they'll try and run away. They'll not just blind, like aimlessly, they just run around like absolute headless chickens. The Normans discovered the source of the Dane threat, an outpost on the water. William had a choice 
Bypass the encampment. Destroy it. Or pay the Danes the gold they demanded. Why on earth? Hey. I'm fought as well. I clear all the enemies out. I'm not bypassing it. This could go horribly wrong. Then again. These archers should probably. Let's see. Wait, can, are they getting through that uh, wall there? Oh, nice. If I can get this tower built, I can just put uh, archers in and suppress them. <laughs> I am losing a ton here, but... Yeah, Dean Camp. I think I've won this one, chat. So this is like kind of a secondary objective, really. We've got some treasure here. Bring the gold, bring the gold. Nice. In destroying the Dane outpost, William stripped the rebels of a crucial ally. Nice. Victory. Well, kind of. I didn't technically have to do that. I've just uh, reduced the um, enemy's um, allies. William's ultimate goal was within his grasp. All that remained was to enter York and destroy its keep. I've only got to go to York and destroy its keep only. Nothing possibly can go wrong. Uh, how we're looking here. stock up on the horses actually i'm gonna have to like restock up on everything because i have just taken a batter in there <clears throat> well it's starting to look like i can't uh, heal at all right now unless I want to send my troops down to uh, the main base um. got 2,000 gold left Um, so what's this here? Do I have any scouts left? Um, right. He can be my, uh, <laughs> he can be my scout. Right, so there's the enemy there. You keep running before you die. Before you die. Okay, so they've got outposts with the slits there. Interesting. Let's just send them there. Send them there. 
Breach the city gate. Wait, didn't they say I could make um, siege? Revive leader. No. Um, stand ground. Oh, there it is there. Baron ram. Durable infantry transport, effective against buildings and walls. That isn't going to last two seconds. <laughs> Move some troops down to heal. Uh... Right now, I can't. I'm so close to being able to attack, and I can just replenish the troops, to be honest. Um... Let's get an air baton ram. Oh, can you not do that, please? Okay, let's make a baton ram. Okay, get all them to build it. There we go. Yeah, right now I don't. I, uh, I don't think it's really worth um, going back to here. I've only got to go there. Siege. Let's go now. Put the hornet's nest. <laughs> nice. I like when you get a little flame symbol above the structure, it literally burns down. See if I can get the siege straight into York like that. Let's see if we can breach the gates first attempt. Oh, that sucks. Never mind. Yeah, maybe we can. Gotta build a siege, working as intended. There we go, nice. The Norman army poured into York and began sacking the town as they bore down on the keep. Uh, don't get too stretched. Let's get that in there. Oh my god, look at all them. Uh, focus, focus on them. It, it's an absolute mess on that gate. Uh, the gate's burning down. Yeah, 
the gift's gonna be down. There we go. Whoa. Okay. Retreat. Retreat. Run. Flee. Flee. Maximum damage. That was, that 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 was the key there. Okay. God, I'm I'm glad I'm not a, like a military leader. Did any archers get out? Yes. How how did that how did that siege get out? Like what? How? <laughs> The most heaviest, bulkiest thing got out. Oh, look how close close I was to the keep. No way. Oh. How the hell? That is some witchcraft, that. Okay, um... Right. What I'm gonna start do- Oh, there's gold here! Get a tower up. There is no way on this planet why that air uh, siege should have uh, survived there, to be fair. But I'm not complaining. <laughs> I'm hoping. Okay. To be fair, if they had come at me with um, troops like this, I can just pick them off. Right. Start moving them there. Get them in that tower there. Cool. Wait, what? Hey, okay. Hey, you just come back here. Start sending them all down there. Protect the gold at all costs. Can I build any? Can I upgrade these anymore? Ah. I'm gonna need a uh, tower here. Are they literally... Hang on, how much they got left? Hmm. God, this is going to be a nightmare, this, if they keep on doing this. Oh, get back, get back. Oh, my leader is apparently an absolute idiot. Get out of there, you clown. You're going to die. I think what I'm going to have to do is just build um, the barracks and stuff here so I can get them out quicker. Ah, 
That's a sizable chunk of gold that though is sitting there. Uh, I think I, I think it's more men at arms I need than uh, sp uh, spears I believe at the minute. Right. They're coming again. Oh god, gotcha. yeah. I legit don't mind just keep on picking them off like this. For the time being anyways. Wait. No, 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 no. We have this sent everything this time. Infinite resources or something? Yeah, that's right. Die peasants. I think um, pretty good on them now. Pop them in there. Wonder, I should I just build a wall, shouldn't I? Let's have a look here. Can I slide that through there? Oh, I can. Them horses are gonna get melted. Perfect. 
The tower's are really OP. I love, I've got a feeling they'll get nerfed, you know, at some point. They were really um, OP in um, the beta. <laughs> I got I got sick of them just running in, so I decided just to air uh, build a wall around it. You fools! Why is there a big gap in the wall there? Okay, that 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 that, that uh, group of troops is just not going down. Villagers go. Oh, there they are there. Alright. Um, I've got to wait until the walls are built, don't I? more of these sieges they're uh, the battering rams and then i'm just gonna go mental on the air uh, keep um, get a couple of people there building that Right, let's go and destroy this thing. All right. Let's go. This is going to be a bit mental, this.
That's probably not the the wisest uh, thing I've done. Get them in there. Get them in there. Go on. They're my diversion. Go on, you can do it. Go on. Oh, nearly. <laughs> Am I really going to just cheese this? Retreat. Yeah, that 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 that's how it happened. That's how it went fell down. To the Norman army, and York was secured. The Northern Rebellion was over, and William the Conqueror was uncontested as King of England. <laughs> hey. Level eight. Uh, continue. Oh wow, that is a pretty healthy air campaign. Look at that bar; it hasn't even moved. William the Conqueror had recaptured York from the rebels. Now he wanted to teach them a lesson for defying him. He began a brutal campaign of destruction to crush any further resistance known as the harrying of the north villages and crops were destroyed it is said a hundred thousand people were killed with ruthless efficiency William the Conqueror had secured obedience in his new kingdom brutal but it wasn't to last it would be thrown into chaos by his own children Possession. When William the Conqueror died in 1087, his favorite son succeeded him. King William II, known as William Rufus. Rufus. But 13 years into his reign, disaster struck. While out hunting, he was killed. He got shot in the eye or something, didn't he? William's youngest brother took his place as King Henry the First, but there was a problem. At the time, Henry's elder brother, Robert, Duke of Normandy, had been on crusade. When he returned, he was furious that Henry had grabbed the throne. From Normandy, Robert attempted to invade England to claim the crown from his brother. But he failed. Brother's jealousy, yeah? And returned home. In retaliation, Henry struck back. In a reversal of 1066, he crossed the Channel and invaded Normandy, intent on undermining his brother Robert's rule. His first target was Bayer. This rich and splendid city was one of the jewels of Normandy. Mm -hmm. Henry was to begin his campaign by unleashing his forces on the city. Bayer was about to feel the wrath of the English army. Longbowmen can deploy healings to effectively guard against the cavalry charge.
So we're in Normandy now, eh? In the brotherly feud over Normandy, King Henry I set out to make an example of Bayeux, a town still loyal to his brother Duke Robert. Henry's archers took up position on high ground outside the city and faced an immediate attack by Robert's cavalry patrol. Mm. Having deployed their palings, Henry's archers were well protected against the cavalry charge. They defeated the first patrol. Cool. <laughs> Destroy the reinforcements. As have Henry arrived. set his sights on burning Bayer, more reinforcements arrived to join his army. Okay. Oh, I didn't realize it was Archie. It all. Did I deploy them too late there? Ooh. Think I just caught that in time there. So yeah, he has the storm walls, guys. What I was on about. They're, they're really nice. Uh, just how? How am I going to destroy this? Let's be honest. The 
the English approached Bayeux and saw that its towering stone walls would not be breached by manpower alone. Henry would need siege equipment and a defensible location to construct it. Of course. Capture the forest village. Take out this tower. I really do like them little pipe. You can run, but you can't hide. Henry now called for the services of a blacksmith to bolster the siege effort. Ooh, Arsenal. Nice. There you were. Here am upper. Uh what we got With a blacksmith on hand, Henry's What's infantry that, would soon be ready to construct siege equipment. It's timber chaos. Down with the work. Research siege engineering. Oh, I don't think I've got any gold yet. Oh wait. Yeah, I think that's gold there, isn't it? Yeah, it's only four thousand. Um. That is close, uh. Have a look here. That should have been a tip that. What perfect day? What perfect day? Each will a delphin. I'm your worker. Double the rate of which filled. Uh, okay, I want that. Uh, I want that. Oh god, yeah. Increase the carry capacity of villagers by 5 and their movement speed by 15. Well, that's just bled my gold dry, that. So, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna build up onto this hill here and put towers up here. Then have my gate down here. Henry's infantry could now construct battering rams. Siege weapons designed to break open fortress walls. Right. Yes, they'll send 
Got eight gathering food, eight gathering wood, and six gathering gold. So let's increase that a bit. The last campaign had quite a few troops on that keep. Do look forward to playing this online though. And your worker. Right. And your worker. Henry's presence on the doorstep of Bayer would not go unanswered. And now his force is braced for an attack by Robert's sure army. Of course they are. Yaru to work. Them pikes from the um, long bowmen are crazy. Henry repelled the attack, but he knew that so long as Bayer still stood, the city would not give up the fight. Thanks for liking the stream, guys. Much appreciated. If you are new here, feel free to subscribe to the channel. Don't usually stream on Thursdays, but uh, Age of Empires is probably my best RTS uh, franchise, so I had to cover this today. I'm just hoping them towers can't reach the walls when I place them here. Um, so that scouts. I'm your worker. Oh. Soon on. Right. Need some more villagers. Pop them in there. Ooh. There's now a group of them there. Ain't your worker? Yes, sir. West to Hala. Ain't your worker? West to Hala. Fuck it, yeah. Need a hit. If you've seen the last campaign I did, you'll know like, the towers are pretty uh, good in Age of Empires 4. So what's the objective? Use the infantry to construct rams. So I need three rams. Get them chopping trees. Uh, or two more farms, maybe? That's going to be tight, that. Pop that yeah, them bells are going to keep on ringing while they're on the walls. Wait, did I have a barrack already? No. Uh, Arsenal, let's check this thing out. Can I get that over here? Oh no, I need the um... <laughs> Wait, why did three of them just build that? Where th I'm 
Wait, what? Oh, it was from the farm, wasn't it? Oh, but yeah, I got all nine farm parcels there. Nice. Each timber of Yarrow to work. Each a worker. Okay. And your worker. Each bouquet that. Each timber of Theos. Bear it on. Right, I can't upgrade them the arrow slits. Actually, I've got no stone. Is there any stone anywhere? Haha, <laughs> you fool. I really don't mind them destroying pieces of wall because the walls are easy to repair. Alright, so we've got an arsenal here. What's this for? Uh, steeled arrow increase the range of damage on steel. Oh! So Longbowmen gain the ability to set up a camp. Which heals them for plus one. That is pretty neat. That. Am I getting a, am I, am I putting a tower here actually? Yeah, that, them long bowmen are just absolutely hazing the enemy. Alright. So I need three Batman rams. Did say three Batman rams, didn't I? Yeah, three Batman rams I need. Damn, they take a while to construct them Baron rounds. We're just gonna send, keep on sending spearmen. I'm not gonna argue with that. a bit of a mess out now right so long uh, they can set up a camp apparently so let's set up a camp so these can start getting healed um. oh so they can overlap them nice hang on so okay that's pretty cool that Uh, let's repair that gap. Each a worker. Did you read it, sir? Um. Yarrow 
to work. It is Sita for actors. So, how fast are they here? Looks like they heal pretty fast when you build the camps of the arch, uh, the long bowmen. Pretty cool. So chat, for the people who've seen uh, the the one play Age of Empires 4, what like obviously if an RTS isn't your thing, fair enough, but what what's different about this um Age of Empires that would put you off uh, playing it? Just out of curiosity. Where's my other ram? I did have... I built one, right? Oh, there it is, sir. Uh... Well, it looks like I'm out of gold, folks. With the power of battering rams, the English army could crack open Bayer's mighty walls. Reach the walls. Um, should I see if there's any more gold kicking about before I, uh, I just go and like Leroy myself in there like an absolute maniac? Let's 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 give this the old uh, attempt here. What's the game? It just says breach the wall, so you can. I'm assuming you can just go in any uh, direction. Bayer's walls had failed, and Henry's men could be safe after work. Okay, Jacob, take it easy, mate. Thanks for hanging out. and made a last stand to defend Bayer, but Henry would show no Have a good day, mate. in cutting them down and burning their city. What's these horses doing, seriously?
Oh man. I like getting that token villager into uh, building some towers. No survivors. What's that thing there? Monastery, let's get that thing out of the way. One thing I love about Age of Empires, just being able to build inside the enemy's base and then just start uh, attacking them from within. Um. Oh, my, my dude died. It's unfortunate. Apparent they've got a palace. You, my friend, go down there. Oh, they're taking a bit of a damage, actually. Them, them arrows seem to be defying the laws of, like... like I need to get another villager over here. Right, you three get over here. Go with that. No, they're starting, to, they're starting to get her up. Go behind on me again. Kill. Oh, damn, I didn't see what kind of HP that had. Destroys the building. Oh, okay. Defeat the defenders.
Rescue. What's that villager doing? It's absolutely bad. Where's my leader? He's gonna be in that palace, isn't he? Oh no. Right. It just keeps on right, not like an absolute clown. As Bayer burned and the people fled in terror, King Henry basked in the victory over his brother Duke Robert. But Henry would not stop until all of Normandy was back under the English crown. Yeah. J J. Mail making video. Wait, what? By 1100, the medieval knight was dressed from head to toe in mail. Mail is really like a metal fabric. It moves oh. and behaves like a cloth, but is actually made of hundreds and thousands I've seen that before. of interlocking it's iron rings. Frodo has, Frodo has mithril. It could turn and deflect a sword blade. As an armor, mail didn't work all by itself. It needed the addition of a padded coat. The coat absorbed the shock of the blow, whilst the mail turned away the cut. Together, they formed an incredibly effective protection. I bet that was hot in that. The first stage in making mail was to create wire to the right thickness. To do this, it was pulled through a drawing plate, which had a series of ever smaller holes. Oh, God. Until you got wire of the desired gauge. To make the rings, we wind the wire onto a mandrel. And then we take it off the mandrel and cut the rings. Oh, that looks like it would be a nightmare, that. So I've flattened the overlapping ends of the ring and I've pierced a hole through it. And now Nick has to put a rivet in it. The basic construction of mail would be a ratio of four to one. So each ring goes through four of its fellows. Here you can see oh, a set no. of five, which will then be joined to other sets of five. To that would have been a mail. nightmare to make that. I, I wouldn't have the patience for that. Fit. It had to be shaped for feet and legs, arms and hands, and of course the head. A skilled mail maker could make very precise shapes. That makes you appreciate that hell of a lot more. For more complicated parts of the body, like elbows, we can actually tailor it in two different directions Damn. at the same time. Yeah. So if we fold this in half, we have an elbow. One of the main benefits of tailoring in mail was that it meant a knight didn't have to carry a single ring of extra weight that he didn't need to. The mail to cover a knight from head to toe required about 200,000 rings. Jesus. High status knights would have had their mail edged with gold. That's crazy, But most crazy, importantly, yeah. it had to be functional. Clad in mail with his shield and helmet, the knight was well equipped to face the weapons of the day. Wow. Okay. Onwards to the next campaign. While Bayer burned, King Henry pressed his advantage. Seizing key fortifications and buying the loyalty of powerful lords, Henry loosened his brother's grip over Normandy. At Tinchebray in 1106, brother would fight... Yeah, I'm still here, man. I'm still here. ...their father's lands. The Battle of Tin... Tin... What is that? Tinchebray? Can't even pronounce that. Yeah, yeah, I've already been live. What? Two hours. Not going anywhere yet. Stone walls cannot be breached without siege equipment. 
two pimp buildings on high ground. Uh, yeah. Okay. Determined to claim Normandy and capture his brother, Duke Robert, King Henry besieged the castle at Tinchebray. Tinchebray. But the direct assault on the formidable stone castle was failing. Unable to breach the towering walls, the king devised a new plan to capture his brother. Okay. Henry would force Robert to defend his lands from attack by raising the villages of Martigny Yet and Fresnes. Oh. These villagers draw out Robert's army. Okay. Father Swithin, it's liber to hear them. I can't get my brother. I'm just gonna burn the uh, local towns. Sounds legit. Robert out of his stronghold, Henry's men would burn the village to the ground. The village of Martigny was destroyed, but still Robert did not emerge to face Henry outside the castle. Henry would have to raise the stakes. Next, he targeted the village of Fren. Henry could buy reinforcements from nearby allies if he could procure the gold to pay them. Henry received word that Robert had sent for a fresh army to aid in defending his position at the castle. Henry had to eliminate these new forces uh, before they could combine with the garrison at Tinchebrae. Cavalry knight, the latest of men. How much gold do I have? Yeah, let's have a tenant. Henry sent gold to his ally in men and received fresh reinforcements. Nice. Oh, them, but them knights look pretty uh, nice. Henry sent gold to his ally in Brittany. 
and in return, a detachment arrived to bolster his numbers. To be honest, I'm glad I got them night there. I had hardly had, you no know, horsemen. By eliminating Robert's incoming army, Henry had thwarted his brother's attempt at strengthening the castle's defences. Um, oh, these can't build the camps yet. Damn. It is Sita for to read no Tulkas. It's Libet to hear it. Fort one day breakfast. Gold, nice. Um, archers, twenty archers. Um, yeah, let's do that. Henry's ally in Bayer sent reinforcements in exchange for gold. At the hands of Henry's army, the village of Fren was in ruins. Henry's provocations had paid off. Robert finally emerged from the castle to face his brother. Robert is on the field. Oh, okay. Right, they're coming for me here, so... I'm gonna just... Do that...
we'll see. I've got this set up right here. Ah, uh, save my leader. No! There we go. Okay, Robert's down. Nice. Getting them archers set up on that hill there was key. King Henry's tactic of luring Robert into the open had worked. Henry captured his brother, and Normandy was his. GG. Level 10. Uh, Battle of... Did I watch these already? While Bayer burned... Yeah, King I've seen that. What's this one? Um, oh, okay. Continue. William the Conqueror's sons had resolved their long feud over Normandy, with King Henry resting possession away from his brother. But the French King Louis VI would not accept Henry's heir as the future Duke of Normandy. Henry's fragile power would face its first test, an invasion by the French King. What's that, guys? It's near a reply to something. Always build up your forces, even if you stop, but uh, you can find you so short. Blah, blah, blah. A chance encounter at the farmlands in Normandy saw King Henry the first face upon the battlefield. Illustrious King Louis the... what's that, fifth? In the disputed countryside between Normandy and France, a smouldering farmstead gave away the beginnings of a French invasion. At the head of the vast army, stood King Louis of France himself. An English scout hastily rode to inform King Henry of England, who was still en route to defend his borders. Hearing of the threat, villagers and guards fled their English-held towns and retreated to the stronghold of Fleury. All right. Hold off the French. Above all, the English forces in Normandy had been commanded to hold the town of Fleury and await King Henry's arrival. So this is the only one I've got to... Right, that's got gold door. Oh. I think I know what I'm going to do here. Uh, I wonder if I can uh, hold this. Yeah. Actually. Are they actually... As the village of Crescenville uh, fell, okay. Damn it. all English hopes 
lay in holding Flurry for the king's arrival. No, no, no. How do I cancel that? Get off. I'm gonna retreat all of these. Put all, of, put all of them back. Yeah. All that's gonna burn. Okay, get all of them back. Um, how we're looking here. The town of Granville succumbed to the French, and the English were pushed back towards Fleury. Okay. Hopefully I can get all these back in time. Right. Get all of these getting gold, I guess. Do I have anyone getting wood? No. Um. All right. Get wood there. Didn't I just tell these to get like get them to get stone? Right. So I've got a blacksmith. Oh, I've got everything. Oh, okay. That's not bad. Do I have a farm? Get a mill down. Oh my god. Isn't uh, looking too good. At last, King Henry and his forces <laughs> made their arrival at Flory. I was actually a bit concerned there. <laughs> Alright, good stuff. Knowing that King Louis himself was on the field, Henry saw his chance to put England's claim to Normandy beyond doubt. Alright. Uh, get rid of that. Alright, need some farms. You can upgrade your unit. What's 
Oh no, I didn't get all nine tiles for the farm. That sucks. Yes, sir. West to Hala. Each timber fails. What surface, eh? Chier la terre. Uh, stone wall. T oh wait, I can upgrade. Wait, what? <laughs> I've got one little lone house up there. Um, what surface, eh? Stone wall. Can I just delete that? Nothing possibly bad can happen from me just deleting my walls. None whatsoever. Are they coming? No, no. King Louis, determined to oust the English from Normandy, began sending attack parties to harass King Henry and his forces. Yeah, it's, a, it's a bit of a pain uh, doing the stone walls on this game. Let's try and, uh... Well, at least they've got to use siege against me now, so. Look at be ready, but read it new, Tolkis. Share less hair. Ain't your work, Oh, really? They literally do have siege. And they're chilling out building siege outside the uh, walls. Still got quite a sizable amount of uh, stone and gold there. Not on the wall, but at least against. All yeah, 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 yeah. You built the um, you snap them on. It says you can build standalone towers as well. Like uh, these ones, yeah. Right, that's. Now I need wood. Each a willow hue of wood. Okay. Decay of 
Oh, how'd you get into the towers again? I need to remember this. Um, can't remember how you actually. How'd you get on the walls again? Hang on. Yeah, I knew you could get. I knew you could get onto the walls. Couldn't remember how. There we go. Get them up there. Wait, I can go up to the third age here by the looks of it. Uh, let's upgrade everything. It would appear that I need to build houses. Yeah, you don't. You, yeah, that, I couldn't remember if you need to put stairs on the walls or not, but no, they come running through the little doorways there. And then they run up. I just couldn't remember uh, in the uh, beta if um, you had to build stairs or not. She's just chilling there on the uh, walls like a complete badass. King's Palace acts as a town center with all the behaviors, technology, units, and bonuses. I think I want that keep. Let's put the keep there to protect the uh, gatehouse. I could have gone with the other uh, landmark, uh, the one that acts like a town centre and placed it up here, but that's just risky as hell. Uh. Yeah, you snap them. Big, to uh, big towers under here. Let's increase the military. Nah. It is Sita, I mean a word of Fed. Suntas. Flamboga, I don't. Yet to be ready for Hestis. All right. Send them there. Food, wood, gold, and stone isn't looking too bad here.
kill them all. Uh, let's try and capture this uh, town back. Push the French out of ground. Okay. I was wondering what that red marker was. Oh crap. Um, Probably not going to be good. I do not know how I survived that. King Henry's men struck at the French forces and recaptured the town. Let's get a hold of that gold. Still don't know how the hell I survived that though. You know I am stonewalling all of this. So stonewall here, run it along here, up through here. Right, upgraded veteran, upgrade horseman to veteran horseman. Hell yes. Yeah, let's just upgrade all of these. Right. I need to get these stone walls up before. No. No. Okay. Keep building the wall you're doing the text. Uh oh. Uh oh. Get out of there. Get out of there. My main guy's like kind of like stuck. He's running around in circles like a madman. Got it. Got it. Oh my god. This is probably not going to end up. Ooh, monastery. Maybe I could do, like, do a death by a thousand cuts sort of thing. Oh my god, increase the range of melee a minute or oh, I'm, I am taking that thing, where's that? Okay. 
So my main guy is kind of like in limbo now. I need a monastery so I can heal my stuff. Yeah, that was a good way of wasting resources, I guess, wasn't it? Right, no, 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 no. just cancel, cancel, cancel. But they can't bring, the, the good thing is, they can't bring these walls down without, unless they've got siege. My main guy's there, but right, it's fine. I can pick myself up and dust myself off. Uh, yeah. That's... <clears throat> it's not as bad as it looks. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what's this? Uh, military Academy, reduce the time it takes to produce infantry. Yes, yes, yes. Give me all of it. I need to just make my guys ridiculously OP. Uh, what's this? Springfield encampment. Add a defensive Springfield encampment to this structure. Sure, why not? Network of Citadel. Increase the network of Citadel. Oh, wait, I can make stuff here. Oh. Veteran Longbowman. I guess he is. If I this this town's just absolutely getting uh, massacred. This is the first real challenge I've had to be fair. So right, okay. I need that. Ah, that's gold. How much gold left? But right, I've only got a thousand gold left, so. This is not good. I need to take that village back. Hmm. I need stuff that doesn't cost gold. Let's go with Spearman. On the plus side, at least I've still got my walls there. Attack on the gore. Where they are. Okay. I don't think that's enough, you know. Do I have a mark? Uh, what do I have a lot of? Sell wood for 70 gold. I'm probably bad at making food, to be fair. There we go. I'll just make another farm. Oh, 
Take them group one. I think it was all the archers that give me a headache um, when they attack to be fair. So the other troops are on their way. There they are there. That can't be it. No way. No, no, where, where, where's that marker? Is that them there? I can't... I think the shrouds are uh, covering them. Yeah, yeah. Wait, one guy? Are you having a laugh? Hang on, what the hell? I need to rescue my leader. No, I'm not just sending one, I'm sending everyone. They've got more troops coming in, that's what that red marker is. Uh, you know what, I'm gonna have to send all of them villagers as well. I need, like, I need a ninja the gold, basically. Oh, wait. I, I have Get a couple of them. Right, I'm gonna hold them there for now. I think I get the full nine parcels there for the farms. Nice. Okay. Right. There's the first monk built. So I can actually start healing my guys now. What? Are they monks or priests? Yeah, monk. Automatic healing on. Okay. I don't know why you'd want that turned off. Is there any upgrades I'm missing for my guys? Get some of them knights. I think everything's fully upgraded. Ich be boon to hear. Harlan and Litas be one. No Hester's an on, Sukas. Men of armies, men of armies, we will forend you. Jonas, Jarek and all, it's do a sword to Hester. I think I've got a better chance of holding it this time there, the town, to be honest. Because it's not much more of the wall I need to get built. I need to get a wall here, down here, and then maybe just around here. To be honest, it's not even much of a town left, so I'm, I don't know what I'm fighting over for. Okay. So I've got all the monks with my units. Okay. Behest 
Wait, did they not leave any um, troops behind? Did they destroy all of it? Oh my god, they destroyed them all. Hey, where did it come from? Build the town center and mark me. Yeah, yeah, I know how to play the game, man. Chill out. I know. This ain't my first rodeo in Age of Empires. You've got to go round now. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, l l let's just build siege right outside the gate when we're like losing everything. Seems like a legit idea. Hey, one then, guys are chilling on my wall. Look at that. Yes, let's not put all of the archers on there. Put them there. <laughs> Alright. Let's try and build this stuff again, shall we?
Hits his seat for Varde Frekes. Mid Baldenes. Yet to be ready for Hestis. Surtis. Here, Hestis. Asteria. Prate, our way men. Dina Munkas Azua their bed. Already saving resources just by having them monks. High damage range unit best against armor and targets and plus and low health. Just keep on going with them. Should have a ton of troops down here. So they're knights, aren't they? Oh, I didn't get all nine tiles. Damn it. I'm getting plenty of food. This is the next town I've got to take this one here. What will thou? Oh. Poor little horse. Poor little fella. Siege workshop, okay. I'll have that. It's in yeah, they their scouts are just not even um surviving now to be honest. What needeth be on board? Arita, what needeth get us to swing and some folk? Hmm. Have I built an arsenal? Where is that? Is that it? That's a blacksmith. Don't think Get I've actually built an arsenal, have I? So I can build the siege f that wait. The white tower, that there uh, to get right, that landmark is pretty old pay, man. It can build everything. So, you got, so in the Siege of Empires, you've got to set up your siege. Because the mangonels on uh, Age of Empires uh, 2, you could just like go mental with them and just move them around and fire. You've actually got to set them up now. Hmm. Oh, what we got here? Yeah, Grease Tackle. Yeah, I want that. Boiling oil towers and keeps gain a boiling oil attack. Oh, nice. Let's have that. Archer's gain plus two. Oh, nice. Oh, actually, give me. <laughs> just give me it all. Some big upgrades there. Uh. 
Uh, yeah, it's considered a keep, but... Uh, well, it's a landmark, but it's a keep, yeah. Like, I had to build this to get the, um... Was it the, the, the third age? So... But yeah, it's it's pretty... Like it says, it's pretty OP. It's like pretty much... There isn't much it can't do. Ha <laughs> ha Yeah, I know you're able to do it. I just think it's a bit overpowering because they're extremely hard to kill as well. Right. I know why I can build them there. Like I said, I, I played this... Like, in the uh, closed beta, it's, like, it's just I didn't think they'd stay that OP. Wait, what? Is there a gap down there? No, Tunkes. He's a sneaky son of a bitch. Sneaky, sneaky. Let's have a look. What should be a huge gap here? I guess if will keep the river. Keeps have always been overpowered in the Age of Empires. Castles, keeps, whatever. Oh yeah, you can just wander straight in there, bloody hell. <laughs> That's my little hole patched up in my base. To be fair, in uh, Age of Empires Day, the only time I really built uh, castles and stuff like that is when uh, I was pushing an enemy, like in multiplayer. Trying to do some gaming of my own. Yeah, take it easy, mate. Thanks for hanging out. Them horses are just getting absolutely destroyed. I want to see that boiling oil. Ah, oh, there it is. Uh... <laughs> oh god. Um I wish I could um 
see that boiling oil a little bit better? Uh, spring gold. Uh, let's build two mongonels. Nothing possibly can go wrong. any more Did I build it? Um, did not build the stables here. Every charm and ten beds. They got to a uh, thousand gold there. New Tulkes, set at you. Look at your weird ear circus. Four one day breakfast with Baldanus. We shall play. No, 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 no. Got Fiazza and Mongonels just absolutely uh, one shot and all my own name. Um... They deploy really quick actually. Time that right. Holy crap. Yeah, I definitely think I timed that right. them down get them get them get them all <laughs> them fire arrows are ripping through them Any trees? I've still got four left.
Them monks are a game changer. We're trying not to destroy anything. Border towns recaptured, King Henry's claim to Normandy faced only one more obstacle. King Louis and his army. All right. In the humble peasants' fields of Bremule, two kings would settle their claim to Normandy. Um, didn't I have a. Didn't I have some loose. Send them up there. And tender threat. Hey, what? What will now? Yes, sir. Is she? Me way is clear. Arkadathala. All right. You then say that's great to know. Seriously. Absolute chaos. Build troops here. Monks. Does this not have a town center? Damn. What needeth be undone? It shall build a that for they. Soon folk are thee ready. It shall have a that he build an on. The campaigns, to be fair, the campaigns are pretty. These are the best campaigns that any Age of Empires have played. And I've played, I, I've played every single campaign right through. Out of every Age of Empires. And the definitive editions as well. Sorry, I'm really enjoying this. I like the little cinematic things to do like in real life as well uh, regarding the history of the battles and stuff that's pretty cool like i said when i was under nda uh, in the closed beta playing this i had not like none of the cinematics or anything like that so Ready. Uh, 
Uh, where did I? Uh, where did I put the market? Not it. Okay. Uh, sell. I'm making an absolute tons of air food here. That's nearly both towns fully air uh, walled off now. Tune folk already ready. Eagle have a he build and adorn. Oh wait, I can actually just join them up. One way in and one way out. Did this have any stone or gold nearby? Put in a gatehouse here actually. Just to play it safe. PVP. Sorry? What do you mean? Oh, a new profile pic. Yeah, it's a new logo, mate. Um, My friend uh, done it for me. Yeah, my um, my old one was uh, like old. Like really old. <laughs> uh, so, yeah. Got a uh, got a new intro to the channel made by my friend today as well. Uh, if you haven't seen it yet. It's it, it's basically a channel intro, um, but only new subscribers uh, really see it uh, when they get directed to my uh, YouTube page. But anyone can view it. Yeah. Um, yeah, she uh, she's done some uh, good work uh, over the past few days. Um, doing my new logo and everything. How are you doing, anyways, Jacob? Got quite a few spam in there, and to be honest, it looks like I need more horses. Um, don't really have that much left. Hmm. Uh, 
Hopefully I can find some stone or gold around here. Let us Uzgat horse. Redende Thernu. Ot Redende Nu. Each fall away, Hesters. Go and default. Can hear like a weird noise over here. What can I do? That. Can you hear like a humming noise? What? Right, that's the Keep on building these towers, I might Wait, I'm out actually out of stone. Oh no. No, 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 oh. no. Hmm. Oh, what? Got no, I've got no stone left. The enemy never just has a, a stable lying around. That's a bit weird. But yeah, I think everyone can agree that uh, my logo needed an, uh, an update. It's um, that 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 is years old. Uh, my old one. So what am I up against here? Uh, this army here. Hmm. So I'm thinking. Um. What need us be on dawn? Cease to Hestus. I might delete these, you know. Hestus for this reason. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> I didn't realize it'd delete them all at once, but. Uh, okay, uh, the mass culling of innocent civilians. Uh, right. See they to work. Eh? I'm sure I had archers, yeah, didn't I? Yeah, I'm definitely going to need more archers than that. Okay. Tune folk already ready. Then they that break the new. What was that? Arita, what need is work at? It killed Bill Day that prevailed. And seal ye build it thing. Hey, everybody, they think they stand. So I can build 10 more archers, well sorry longbowmen, because the idea is I'm going to set up my longbowmen here and put the pikes on the floor because they have a lot of horses. Let's see if I've got any spear down here. Ah. Do I have any down here? Actually, yeah. I need everything here. Send them up there. Every man and woman for themselves here. I've got to make this count. Oh, 
is Ibun. Can do three more. But I can do flaming arrows as well, so... If you haven't liked the stream yet, guys, make sure you hit that like button. And if you're not subscribed and you're new here, go ahead and subscribe. I stream Mondays. Wednesdays, Fridays, and Saturdays, but when there's games out like this, like brand new games, I will do like a stream on my off days. Why are these taking the scenic route? Got another stable there. Uh, that should be fine, just yes, leave it. Way, Explains away all them scouts are coming from earlier on. I wonder if I can bait these out actually. I wonder if I could. Yeah, actually, yeah, let's try and bait these out. So I'm going to use these and put the pikes down in front of them. Chat, just think. It's only nearly a week away. Until. The new missions for Icarus. Not that I'm excited or like anything, you know. Hiya, Bri. How you doing, mate? Um, I'm good, I'm just chilling, you know, playing some Age of Empires 4 and release. Okay, there we go. Now, this is the bait, guys. This might be a good play. It might be a bad play. We'll see. We'll see. The horse is going to be able to run right through the middle of them, unfortunately. Which is probably not the best thing, but... Let's get this, uh... Let's get this, uh... Party started. Get the monks up there. That includes you, you're a monk. I wish you could draw a line like you can do in a total war. Uh, that might work, maybe. Yeah, that'll have to do. Saddled up on the ready. He saddled up and redende. Reader as he set on ready. That will be your dawn. Ah, to creep this yard. Okay, so the trap is sprung. Get these to hide in the trees so they can get the archers. Because you can hide in the trees on this and you get shrouded. Alright. I want the cavalry around the back. That's probably not good cover to be fair. Okay, no mind we'll just burn a structure down while we're here. 
I need... I'm, I'm pretty sure I can just send one horseman over just to get beaten out. Right, let's give this a try. Let's see how this goes. Oh, come on. Come on. It's working. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, no. Right, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Right, I think this can work, you know. And oh, come on, can't I, I? I think. Oh. I talk. Right, okay. <laughs> Chat watches. Okay. <laughs> this is, I'm gonna choose it, watch it. <laughs> right. I'll put the new um I'll put the new spikes down. There we go. Perfect. Um Oh, I don't know what. Eh. Nah, that wedge formation's pretty scuffed. Right. So let's put the air peelings down. Right. Let's put the camps down here so they can heal themselves. Can't rely on the monks. That's pretty good coverage. Make that group too. Make that group three. Make that group four. This is one hundred percent going to work this time. Come on. Wait, what? Um. What? I try one. Come on. I need my. There we go, there we go. That's what we wanted. <laughs> Swing the horses round the back for the archers. There we go. Mask of the archers. Swing round, kill, kill the king now. Guys, by the way, as a big fan of Total War, so like I love doing this kind of stuff. Oh. There we go. I'm not just good on survival games. Far from home, <laughs> but rallied by their king, the English army forced a French surrender and put King Louis and his knights to oh, flight. Hey. GG. With the impromptu battle ending in resounding victory for the English, King Henry had secured his ancestral lands under the English crown. That's a good, I like that. You do actually have to think a bit more on this age of empires to what a you, you can't just run your air uh, troops in. Um, all right. Uh, so we've got some new stuff here. The Battle of uh, Bramuel. Um, 
So that's not a video. Falcon, Falcon. See, this is what I like about this one. That you get like videos like this. Norman domination over England was marked by their imposing castles and new laws. But one passion of theirs also impacted the land. Hunting. The last video was all about making chin mail. The Norman nobility, both men and women, shared a love of hunting with birds of prey. To preserve their hunting grounds, they took ownership of the land and outlawed hunting by commoners. Falcons hunt by flying to a great height, then dive bombing their prey. They are kept hunting fit using a lure, a pad of leather with bait attached. This prepared them for catching their prey, usually other birds such as rooks and pheasants. Gorgeous birds, them, aren't they? While out hunting, a falcon might give chase to its prey far from the party. Really nice. So, riders would follow them cross-country on horseback to witness the action. After a huh. falcon had caught its prey, it was fed and would not fly again that day. This meant many birds had to be taken on a hunt to keep the nobility entertained. Hmm. Rather than falcons being carried on horseback, which would jostle them, they were transported on a frame called a cadge. That's weird, isn't it? That's proper strange, huh? Although falconry was a horseman's sport, hawking was enjoyed on foot. Hawks, unlike falcons, have broad wings and hunt by following their prey in straight flight, often low to the ground through woodland. Hunting by sight, a falcon's vision is highly developed. When not hunting, they were kept calm by putting on a leather hood. They look horrible, them, them hoods. The darkness stopped them becoming overstimulated and restless. Lords of the sky, controlled by the lords of the land. Falcons and hawks were symbols of power and status. Wow. They were central to Norman identity. Well, chat, you learn something new every day. All right. Um, let's have a look here. Are you sure you want to come here? Let's have a little look, see if I've unlocked anything. First Battle of Lincoln. Uh, oh, that's my, oh my, oh, so you get, oh, that's pretty cool. So what's, uh, so the skirmish, has this changed? Ooh. How many peels on the multiplayer at the minute? I bet you it's I bet you it's stacked, isn't it? Doesn't it have lobbies? I mean, it had lobbies in the beta. Oh, there we go. Damn, that's not many games, actually. Interesting. All right, chat. Well, that's me for today. I'm actually going to be playing this again tomorrow. Uh, I don't really have that much go uh, to play at the minute. Uh, not many... Uh, survival games out there I really want to uh, pick up and uh, play uh, as we've only got like a week left for uh, Icarus again so yeah I think I'm going to uh, continue on uh, playing the campaign tomorrow for this um, so yeah I think that's all I'm going to do guys uh, if you haven't liked the stream already go ahead and give it a good old like uh, subscribe to the channel uh, let's get me to the uh, was it 660 subscribers by the end of tonight and 
yeah i'll see you all tomorrow about 3 p.m gmt plus one uh until then guys take it easy bye bye